May 3rd, 2020. A month later, June 29th. Six days later, July 5th. Firefighters were on the front lines while most of us were in our homes working remotely in the early months of the pandemic. At that time, there was no vaccine, but firefighters were out there doing their jobs. Fast forward to today, L.A. Firefighter Jeff Burmeister is ready to put his job on the line. One of those who started Firefighters for Freedom with some 526 others who are taking a stand against a city council mandate that they must be vaccinated. At issue, they don't want to be told what to do and feel they have earned the right to discuss vaccines rather than be mandated to get them. I think that we realize that it's, it's time for us to kind of make a little bit of a stand for uh, personal freedoms that we feel like are being stripped away. And so this was a way of us kind of coming together and bonding with the rest of the people in our department that feel the same way, way we do, that uh, this whole issue, this city mandate, uh, should be just basically about um, personal choice. Under the California Constitution, every person in the state of California has an inherent right to privacy. That's our main point. Kevin McBride represents Firefighters for Freedom. He and a team of lawyers have filed a lawsuit in Superior Court asking for injunctive relief. He says there are several legal points. The second... The Los Angeles City Council exercise authority beyond its constitutional authority. And why, why they did that is this. The ordinance <clears throat> impacts constitutional rights. And therefore, the City Council doesn't just have a free hand to do whatever it wants. Meanwhile, firefighter Burmeister and the others in the ranks are serious about this. If you end up on the losing side of this court battle, you're willing to accept termination and that's it. Unfortunately, if it came to that, if the city terminated us, um, it would be a huge loss for the city and it would be a huge loss for all of us personally, uh, a job that we love. but. Uh, yeah, this is this is that big of a decision for us. The attorney for the firefighters says he hopes there can be a settlement with the city before this gets to a full-blown trial. I'm Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News. L.A. City Council Member Mark Ridley Thomas issuing this statement. It reads in part, it is simply not right for city employees who should be setting an example for the general public to resist what is in the best interest of themselves, their families, their communities, and the workforce.